it was about 30 minutes ago. Let's turn our attention then to Cosmos Films. Uh, the company reported the Q2 numbers, revenues were flat, but there is a sharp margin improvement reported by the company's margins improved from 6% to 11.6% in the quarter gone by. The stock is flat, but it's already rallied 90% so far this year. Pankaj Poddar, uh, the CEO of the company, now joins in. Uh, Mr. Poddar, um, you know, morning, uh, your revenues were flat in this quarter. Are you expecting a pickup in uh, volumes in the second half of the year? What is your guidance? And secondly, on margins, is it sustainable at these levels? Yeah, so we are fully utilized and therefore we do not expect a significant ramp up in the revenues. Uh, we have added master batch plant this year and uh, that should add maybe 100 crores on an annualized basis. Uh, the line has just started a couple of months back and we expect it to be fully utilized by year end. Uh, as far as the margins are concerned, our speciality growth has been phenomenally good. We have grown 16% so year on year. Not just that we are growing speciality, we are growing at a faster rate on a much bigger, uh, you know, the base now. Uh, and therefore, uh, we expect that the margins uh, will remain quite strong for us. All right. Uh, what do you mean uh, by them remaining strong? Will they be around that 11.5%, 12%? And, uh, you know, the last time you joined us, you did say that there was some increase in spreads of BOPP. What do they stand at right now? How do they compare with the average of the second quarter? So we are not, as Cosmofilms, we are not as dependent on the vagaries of market pricing because mm -hmm. 57, 58% of our sales now is driven by speciality sales. Uh, however, to answer your question, uh, uh, the spreads on the basic films are close to 33, 35 rupees a kg. And they have been fluctuating a little bit here and there, uh, but we are able to, uh, you know, take that uh, uh, fairly well into, uh, you know, into our, uh, the way we are conducting our business. And again, a major part of our business is now linked to raw materials. So it, it really doesn't impact us as much. Okay. Uh, you said 57 to 58% of your revenues come in from speciality firms. Uh, what are the margins that you generate on this and the revenue growth that you've seen in the first half of the year and your outlook? So we grew 16% as I said earlier. And normally the speciality margins are two and a half times of... Uh, uh, the normal BOPP films. Uh, obviously it changes because the commodity margins keep changing while the speciality margins are more stable linked to raw material. Uh, and yes, uh, we are going very beautifully and uh, we should continue and our target is that within two years we should have 70% of our sales coming from speciality assets. Right. Uh, Pankaj, you know, the last time you joined us, uh, you spoke about a bit of a pivot that the company had taken into the pet care business. You were to invest around 15 crore rupees in that vertical mm -hmm. How has it uh, 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 happened so far in your business, about a couple of months? What do you expect? What's the visibility? What sort of market uh, do you expect uh, for this business? Yes, the first thing I will say is that uh, the initial reaction of investors, of uh, the people in this business is uh, extremely strong and uh, they are feeling very good about it that uh, an organized player is coming to deal with the segment. This segment is growing at 22%. And uh, however, the penetration in the expenditure is still low and, and uh, it's still around 6,000 crore market, but it can really grow very nicely. Uh, we have already have uh, got the business head uh, whose name is Ambrish. Uh, he comes uh, with several years of experience in the pet care space. Uh, we also have a new member joining us. Uh, so we have started creating team. The portal work has started. And uh, so are the other things, uh, you know, whether it uh, in terms of branding of the business, whether in terms of uh, looking at opening these stores. So I think the team is doing an extremely nice job and we expect that uh, in Q1 of next year, we should be able to launch our portal as well as we should be able to start opening our stores. And we are looking at two things here, you know, we are, uh, first it will be omni-channel in the sense that we have our own stores as well as we'll be online, uh, both on our portal as well as some of the marketplaces that are there in the market. Uh, the other thing is that we will uh, be doing both products as well as the services part. And if you really see, uh, getting the services has been a big challenge till date. We are trying to bring a lot of structure to the entire thing uh, by opening our own academies where we can train the trainers, uh, we can train the, uh, uh, the groomers, we can uh, maybe help the veterinarians uh, to learn more about the uh, pet dogs, uh, you know, the cats as well. Uh, you know, because right now there is no uh, course 
specifically for the uh, veterinarians as well. Uh, and we will do these services ourselves. We'll make a marketplace to make sure that the consumer gets professional services uh, from an established, reputed, and organized player. So that is what we are going to do, and uh, we are tracking very well on it. Pankaj, all the best for that, uh, and season's greetings to you and everyone at Cosmos Films. Uh, that's uh, the word coming in from the management. Let's invite Mitesh Thakkar to get.